Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Welcome back to chapter one. Let's finish it up. Um, we just got done talking about a scientific theory. The uh, theory that most people um, uh, have a problem with is the theory of evolution. Um, evolution is happens in everyday life. We have so many pieces of evidence for evolution. Um, a, a great example of a change in gene frequency uh, through artificial selection is um, dogs. What do we believe uh, the dogs come from? Well, dogs probably all came from wolves. Do any dog breeds today still look like a wolf? Maybe a couple. Like maybe a husky. Like maybe, you know, uh, a German Shepherd kind of. But no, none of them look like wolves. So how do we get from a wolf which down to modern dog breeds? Like a chihuahua. How do we get there? We do it through artificial selection. We do it by deciding who reproduces in the next generation. If this individual was allowed to reproduce and that one isn't, then that's unequal reproductive success. Unequal reproductive success leads to a different combination of genes in the next generation. Um, evolution is observable in everyday life. Um, we have deliberately um, bred, goodness, and any kind, any species that we keep, um, dogs, cats, fish, snakes, lizards, um, tomatoes, green beans, corn, wheat, soybeans, any kind of a pet or a food source, we have selectively bred to, uh, for certain traits. That is artificial selection. Um, that was on purpose. We've also accidentally selected for pesticide resistant bugs and for antibiotic resistant bacteria. There are several strains of bacteria that are resistant to every, back to every um, antibiotic we can make. Well, just make some more. Yeah, we are, we're trying. We didn't just make some and stop. We're trying to make more, but the problem is that the bacteria become resistant to the antibiotics quicker than we can develop new ones. We have accidentally, through unnatural selection, made pesticide resistant bugs and made antibiotic resistant bacteria. Thanks for joining me on chapter one. See you soon in chapter two.